guys and welcome you back to join graphic tutorials so in this tutorial we are going to design a birthday flyer but before then if you haven't subscribed to join graphic tutorials or join graphic channel i just want you to quickly subscribe to this amazing channel for more amazing graphic design tutorials so let's quickly head on to creating our nice and beautiful flyer so first of all i will just go to my new file so I just want to give it a title first. So let's give it a title as birthday, birthday flyer. Then let's go on and set the width to 1100 and let's set the width also to 1100. And we are going to set the resolution to 300. Then after we are done with this, we can go on and hit on our OK. So guys, this is the background that we are going to work on for our today's session of tutorial. So before I start with anything, I just want to go to my view and go to my guys and go to my new guide layout. I just want to apply all these setups or these settings so that everything that I will do, I will know that I am just in the right alignment. So let's go on and hit on ok so this is the background that we are going to work on so first of all i just want us to go to our file and go to our place link so we just want to go to the place where our resources are so these are the resources that we are going to use for our today's session of tutorial our birthday flyer so i just want to bring this one first inside so i'll make sure that it takes the entire background like this very nice and very beautiful so I will just select it and go to my panel here and go to my hue so I just want to set the hue to plus 28 something like this very nice and very amazing so I'll go back to my layers and this is what I actually want to set so I'll go on to my file again go to my place link and this time I just want to bring this flare inside so I will just select this flare here and change the blending option to something like screen so I just want to expand this flare like this so I just want to widen it a little bit like this so this is what I actually want to do very nice and very amazing so I will just want to duplicate it Control plus J to duplicate it like this so that i'll get an effect like this i just want to add some brightness to the background like this so after i'm done with this quickly i just want to go on and bring other resources inside so let's bring these resources inside very nice and amazing so i just want to push this here very nice and beautiful so i'll just want to select this flyer or this image here and go to my filter and go to my Gaussian blur so i just want to blur this to about a radius of 7.2 like this so i will just go on and hit on ok so control plus it to duplicate it then i'll bring the same thing down here so that i'll get an effect like this so i can go on and be adjusting it so this is what actually i just want to do so after i'm done with this i'll go on and add some typography to what we have just done so i'll just open up my typography tool and i just want to type something like um birthday like this so i will just select it and make sure that the size is about 60 very nice and very very amazing so this is the size that i actually want it to be very nice so let's make sure that it is actually at the center of the flyer so this is what i actually want to do so after we are done with this we can go on to our file and go to our place link and we want to bring this image first inside something like this very nice and amazing so this is what actually i just want to create very amazing so we can just push the birthday a little bit down so that we will create 
uh, uh, something like this very amazing and very beautiful so after we are done with this we go to our file again go to our place link and now we can bring also this one inside this image inside but we will make sure that we resize it a little bit like this something like this very amazing and very beautiful so we can just go on and open it up a little bit so this is what we actually want to do very nice and very very amazing so after we are done with this we will still go on and add some gradient to what we have just done so i just want us to add a gradient so we will set our foreground color to a code of ac0958 so this is what we are going to set our foreground color to so we just hit on okay then we go here and set our gradient so i just want to set a gradient like this then we'll go to the gradient bar and i just want us to push the white a little bit forward like this until we get something like this very nice and very amazing so after we've gotten something like this we go on and hit on okay then here to okay now we are moving forward so i just want us to add some flare to what we have just done so let's go to our place link and let's bring this flare once again inside so after we have brought this flare inside i just want us to change the blending option to something like a screen very nice and very very amazing so this is what i just want us to change the flare to very nice and amazing so we can position the flare here very beautifully and we can pick up our brush like this then we can do some little cleanings on the flare a little cleanings on the flare so i just want us to clean around the flare so that we get something like this very nice and very amazing so after we have reached here i just want us to add the name of the person who is celebrating the birthday so let's pick our typography to and add a name like so i just want us to reduce the size of the typography so let's add a name like elisa something like this very nice and very beautiful so let's place it just here and we can go on and increase it a little bit like this very nice and very very amazing so we can also add our typography another typography like happy so this time we will select it and change the font to something like um, um, adobe grand mode or we can change it to this font adobe garamond yes that's the name of the font so i just want us to bring that one here very nice and very very amazing so this is what we are actually having for now so we can go on so if you have any birthday wish that you just wanted to add to the flyer so I just want to add a random test just below here, a random test. So let's reduce the font to about six and let's change the font to Roboto. So you can just add your random font here. Very nice and very amazing. So let's bring it just on top of the layers very nice and very amazing so if you have any wish that you wanted to add to your flyer you can just bring them here very nice and very amazing so after we are done with this we will still go on and add some few resources to what we have just done so I just want to bring back this flower inside so let's reduce the size and let's push it down here 
very amazing and beautiful so we can duplicate it control plus j and bring the duplicate also up here very nice and very very amazing so after we are done with this we can go on and also add some a little things to it so i just want to bring this thing inside very nice and amazing and i just want us to select it and go to our blending options so we are going to color overlay and make sure that it is white so i just wanted us to change this to white so we will just reduce it to a size like this and we can just bring it for to two we can just bring it at this place so i just want to bring this just for the creation purpose so this is actually the end of our flyer so you can now see that the flyer is actually very very beautiful so you can just study along these tutorials and come out with a lot of different approach in making birthday flies so i have just left all the resources beneath the description you can go on and download it and study along this tutorial for more amazing insight into graphic designing so this is the end of the tutorial and i hope we are going to meet at another time and if you haven't subscribed to the channel i just want you to subscribe to the channel for more amazing graphic design content so we are going to meet again bye bye